Criminal defense is very unique. You're dealing with people that don't have a budget for lawyers, and yet you're getting them at their lowest point. They really need help. They really need assistance. They're very vulnerable. And it's always gratifying to help somebody out of a delicate situation with the hope and expectation that you don't see them again. I grew up in a very small town in North Dakota called Starkweather. My parents owned a grocery store. My wife and I spend the winters in Florida, but that's never going to be home. North Dakota is always going to be home for us. Um, this is where our family is. This is where our friends are. You know, I started the criminal defense practice in this law firm. There certainly were attorneys here before I got here that would take an occasional court appointment in federal court, but there was nobody that focused their practice on, on criminal law. And it started essentially with me, and at one point we probably had seven, eight, or nine lawyers doing almost full-time criminal defense work. I'm very proud of that. As I slowly try to retire, I've been trying this for a number of years, I think I still have a lot to give back. And so that's the reason I continue to teach, that's the reason I continue to mentor. And the law has always been very, very rewarding for me, personally.